welcome to another video tutorial in this video i will show you how we can write high quality and in-depth systematic reviews or review of literature using ai tools so for today i will be using SciSpace recently launched feature deep review so we will be testing this feature so what you need you need to just sign up and go to this deep review feature by simply clicking on this deep review feature so you can enter your search query in this tab so let's try anything which i know and which is related to my field so this question is i mean just rarely research like what is the role of velvet this is just new terminology i mean if you are into the like plant sciences you you would know that this terminology is quite new uh, i mean this is just published in just few papers so let's test if this size space uh, know about this and uh, what is the role of velvet layer in fertility so we can simply make a question and press on this enter so let's see if it knows about this and if it has you can see now it has more power of thinking and it sometime also asks you question i mean your query is related to this i mean it is just give you a way to reconfirm the way you are thinking so you can see it is asking please answer the following question to enhance the query and are you interested in the role of velvet layer in fertility for a specific animal species or plant type so would you like to explore the impact of environmental factor on the velvet layer role in fertility yeah so we can tell that uh, i am looking for plants and yes i would like to explore impact on environmental factor as well yeah it is just like you are interacting with humans so you can see now as the ai is advancing so it is giving you more and more power to control and refine your research with great precision so i have just entered my instruction to just refine and sometimes you know the open eye ai and other tools may give you open-ended i mean something which is not published in the research paper it is giving the suggestion so we can just submit this one so you can see now it is running the literature review and executing multiple relevant queries to broaden the research so you can see the three top paper out of 350 and now it is just expanding the level and the number of papers so we can see uh, if it will give you the crosstalk you can see it is giving the now effects of cold stress and something like reproductive stress and it is giving you the fertility improvement of sandy soil by wettier grasses and mulching and we can also go to the reviewing for citation and references to identify the additional relevant works so you can see the velvet layer a term not explicitly defined in provided papers yeah perfect because yeah i already mentioned i mean this term is totally new appears to be conceptual right perfect yeah i mean this is the good example or structural component related to the plant fertility particular under the environmental stresses yeah perfect based on the research the role of such layer can be through the potential involvement in the pollen development and their function and overall fertility maintenance under these conditions so now uh, let's ask that same question uh, from the chat gpt like what is the role of velvet layer in fertility what is the role of velvet layer in fertility
yeah you can see the velvet layer tapetum in some plot yeah actually this is part of tapetum so it's not the tapetum is a specialized structure in the anther that plays important role in fertility in particular the velvet layer is found in the inner layer of the anther wall yeah actually it is right i mean it it, it is uh, located on the inner wall and which surrounds the pollen sac it has the several role like uh, in nutrient provision pollen development protection and the regulation of pollination so we can go back and ask and see if it has given you you can see the on the environmental regulation and transcription factor and you can see that even it has mentioned few transcription factor which are also involved in the pollen development and the pollen viability under these conditions uh, so we can go ahead and read more so you can see it has also given you the examples from non-coding rna and environmental surveillance heat stress impact and uh, this is also giving you that simple transposon surveillance mechanism and carbohydrate metabolism and now maybe it is going to be like the more generalized this size space deep review it is giving you the references and uh, yeah this reference is uh, totally new you can see uh, actually this velvet layer is just mentioned in few paper like in 2023 and onward so it is giving the right references but i mean the chat gpt is giving good explanation compared to this uh, size space but it lacks references although i am using the free version so if you want to answer just from a few paper might be we can only select from the five papers so then the that query will be further refined and will be only selected from the top five paper so you can see now it has just shortlisted that only three paper which were in 2023 so as i am using this deep review feature from SciSpace and it is paid if you also want to buy this so here are my discount codes and i will paste my deep review utm link in my video description you can directly click on this link to get 40 percent discount on annual plan and 20 percent discount on monthly plan and for 40 percent you can just use my discount code asif doctor 40 and for 20 percent if you want to buy a monthly plan so you can enter asif doctor 20 and if you are from india then you have 20 percent uh off on both advanced monthly and annual plan so you can use then ali doctor 20 and if they are they will be recently integrating new features in the browser control weight link so i will also paste this link so this deep review feature from SciSpace will also be very helpful for your review of literature and if you have any question, please let me know in the comment section. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.